Hey everybody, and welcome back to Misfit Corner Scams. As the R's knows, Andrew speaking, and it's time for another scam call. This is an interesting one in the fact that Lisa from Medicare called to try to get me in touch with a licensed agent in order to get extra benefits on my Medicare. And for some reason, we were just not able to get in touch with anybody. What's really funny is the first message that I got when she tried to transfer me was, you are on our do not call list. Click. It's like... Why did they call in the first place if they know they're not going to talk to me? But she kept trying. Never did get through, but she kept trying. I love wasting their time. And if you get calls like this, either hang up on them or screw with them like I do. It's always fun. I'm still waiting for Lisa to call me back. I know she will. I know they will. That is wonderful to know. Um, there have been recent changes plans and rates in your area, and you may be able to get lower rates or additional coverage. You can know saving up to $50 to so $100 on your plan. What I do is I get a licensed agent on the line to go over the possible lower rate and additional coverage with you and check if you qualify for plans that will help with co-pays and deductibles that are not covered by Medicare. You have your part and being paid, correct? Yes, yes, I do. Uh, what did you say your name was again? I'm sorry. My name is Lisa. Oh, okay. Okay, sir. Um, and are you between the ages of 65 to 79? Yes, ma'am. Okay, wonderful. Uh, just to confirm, you're not currently looking for Medicaid state coverage, correct? No. Okay, wonderful. Um, do you have an advantage or a supplement plan on your Medicare? Um, I just have the Medicare plan. I don't have anything additional. Okay. Can you visit any doctor or do you need to stay within a network? I have just one doctor that I see, my primary doctor. Okay, sure. Okay, great. Lastly, just to confirm, you are interested in speaking to a licensed agent now to go over the Medicare supplemental plans available. You're not obligated to enroll. It is to listen and see if this new rate and coverage can benefit you. Is that okay? Sure, sure. Okay, wonderful. Okay, sir. Um, before I do transfer the call to the agent, I will just ask you a couple of questions very quickly. Can I kindly have your first name? Timothy. Timothy? Yes. Okay, now can I have your last name? Williams. Okay, great. Now can I have your street address? 611 East Adams Street. Adam Street. Okay, mm -hmm. great. Okay, sir. Now, can I have your zip code? Three two two zero two. Okay, that is three two two zero two. Yes. Okay, and that is Jacksonville, Florida. Yes. Okay, just let me enter this information quickly. Okay. Okay, great. Okay, sir. Now, um, can I kindly have your date of birth? March 1st, 1955. 55? Mm-hmm. Okay. March 1st, 1955, and that makes you 67 years of age? Yep, that's correct. For another month and, okay. month and a few days. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, sir, you will hear me press a couple of buttons to ensure that I get you the right agent. Okay. I will introduce you once we pick up, okay, sir? Okay. Um, just bear a moment with me. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay, sir. We're just waiting for the information to be generated so that I can transfer the call to the license agent. Okay. This will just take a couple of seconds, okay? Okay. okay. Thank you very much for your time and for understanding. So where are you calling from? Uh, yes, sir? I, I was just asking oh, we where... Are located in Cle... Oh, sorry. We are located in Cleveland, Ohio, but oh. the license agent I get for you is located nearby. Okay, sir? Oh, okay. Okay. That's the reason we ask you. 
for the zip code so that whenever we transfer the call to the agent, it's an agent that will be close to, to your location, okay? Yeah, well, my phone is showing that you're calling, that the number that's calling me is from Florida, and you say you're in, where, Chicago? No, I, I said Cleveland, Cleveland, Ohio. oh, okay. Well, Cleveland, Chicago, same thing. It's up north. Okay. So why does my phone yeah. say you're calling so from have, Florida? We have agents all over, sir. We have some agents in Florida as well. Yeah. Like I said, we are just call agent, dialer, and, you know, oh. we get the numbers and they... Okay. Yeah. So you... Okay, sir. Well, I will, trans I will transfer the call for you now, okay? Oh, okay. So the bottom line is you want to you wanna, you wanna hide the number that you're calling from. That makes sense. Oh, no, sir. I, I will transfer the call to the licensed agent. Oh, please okay? do. Please, please do. Thank you. Okay, thank you. I will introduce you once they pick up, okay, sir? Oh, I'm still here. Just waiting. <gasps> You're sorry. Your number is in our do not call list. Goodbye. <gasps> what was that? Okay, sir. One moment. I will try the other line. Okay. <gasps> What did that what did that message mean? That was weird. Okay, one moment. Okay. Okay, sir. It seems that our agents are busy at this time, but can I give you a call back? Sure. No problem. I like talking to you. That's okay, fine. Okay, sir. Thank, thank you very much and have a wonderful day. Goodbye. Thank, thank you, Lisa. I think it's funny how they try to transfer you to an actual agent. And the message is, you're on our do not call list. Well, you're you're actually calling the agent. They know something's up. They know they're doing wrong. So that's why they don't want to let, that's why the agents don't want to talk to you. But uh, that's wonderful. Hopefully they will call back. Hope she calls back. She had a nice voice. Love it. Hey everybody, and thanks a lot for checking out the video. If you like the content, click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notification. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down, either way, and we'll catch you all next time.